Research has always been the key to discovering new and innovative treatments that will improve patient care and help to prevent and cure disease. At Royal Brompton and Harefield NHS Foundation Trust, we are at the forefront of innovation, always looking for the safest and fastest ways to deliver groundbreaking treatments to patients. Many of our successes have been research firsts. In 1948, we played a pivotal role in the first clinical trial of antibiotics for tuberculosis. In 1983, we undertook the world's first successful combined heart and lung transplant. Since 2010, we were the first UK centre to trial genetic therapies for the treatment of cystic fibrosis and heart failure. There are around 200 clinical research studies taking place in our hospitals, looking at different aspects of heart and lung disease. There are projects to investigate how cardiac and respiratory diseases develop, like severe asthma and inherited cardiac conditions. We're also looking at how and why these diseases progress and what role genetics plays next to environmental factors. Also, many of our patients are involved in clinical trials, testing new imaging techniques, surgical devices and drug therapies. This research would not be possible without the 5,000 patients who volunteer to help us every year. Their contributions range from answering questionnaires and providing blood samples to participating in international clinical trials, all of which offer unique and valuable insights into these patients' conditions. This research enables us to develop a greater understanding of heart and lung disease, leading to more effective treatment options. Improved treatments can lead to more personalised care for patients and help reduce costs for the NHS. Our research benefits not only patients at our hospitals, but patients across the world. And it doesn't just help people today, but future generations too. If you would like to find out more or get involved, visit our website, rbht.nhs.uk slash research.